All right, guys, update video. Uh, we are in the Smokies. Uh, I think we're something like 16 miles in. Just past Spence Field Shelter um, on our way to Rocky Top. Um, came across this nice open area. So I decided to kind of kick back, take a pack off break, eat some trail mix. I was listening to some CCR, drinking some water, chilling, absorbing this sunlight that has come out uh, because ever since yesterday when we decided to head into the Smokies it has just been rainy, windy, and cold. Um, yesterday was a pretty tough day doing the 10 mile climb in, um, but you know we knew it was going to be like that. I kind of wore the least amount of clothes that I had to so that I had as much dry clothes as possible for when we got to the shelter. Um, paid off because got there, got warm. The shelter even had a fireplace which was awesome. I had heard the shelters in the Smokies were really nice from people, but I didn't know how much I'd believe them. But sure enough, we get to, uh, what shelter was it? Molly's Ridge Shelter uh, last night. We got a huge tarp up to block the wind. Um, fireplace in there, which is just really nice. Um, a lot of things or places to hang and had skylights. All in all, it was good. It was a good hike. Um, by the time everybody got there, everybody was steaming with sweat and wetness. Once we got in there, it kind of looked like a meat locker with everything hanging around. Um, but yeah, uh, I can't really remember the last time I updated. I guess when we were on our way into Fontana. Um, the hike was good. Um, made our way from the Knock to Fontana. I think it took us two days. Um, Jacob's ladder was a little bit tough, but uh, once we got over that, we had some great views. Um, and just did the climb. Actually, I think we went to Cable Gap Shelter. No, was it Cable Gap? Um, when? Before Fontana. Um, yeah, I think that yeah. was it. No, Sassafras. Was it Sassafras? Yeah, that was the one right before Fontana. Okay, one of those one of those shelters right before Fontana. Damn. We stayed there and. Um, and uh, woke up early the next morning and did the six or seven miles down into Fontana and got there and kind of tapped into their Wi-Fi and started uploading videos and charging my headlamp and my phone and they had laundry so we did laundry, bought little things that we needed to get through the Smokies, went and ate at the restaurant, got a really good burger. Um, just and it, the weather was nice that day so we just kind of ended up staying there plus I wanted to stay at the Fontana Hilton which is one of the nicer if not the nicest shelter on the AT um, it's got hot showers it's got toilets um, a big fire ring it's right on the water sleeps like 30 people um, so yeah we ended up staying there two nights ago and uh, and then waking up yesterday and and Showing the rangers our permits and hiking into the back country of the Smokies. Um, but yeah, we're here now. Um, had some bad weather, but it's really clearing up and came to this open area. And I was like, man, I got to lay down in this grass and just absorb some of this heat because my clothes are just starting to dry from yesterday because, you know, woke up and put all the wet clothes from yesterday back on um, just to avoid, to avoid getting more of my clothing wet. Um, lady just pulled in. She's gonna sit down and take a break with me, and she brought an orange that she uh, has packed out since Siler Bald Shelter. We found it at the shelter. Big, huge, sun-kissed orange. So she gave me a little bit of that. So I'm gonna enjoy that here. Um, and then, yeah, we're headed to uh, Derek. Derek. Knob. Knob Shelter, I think it's called today. I think it's 12 miles we're doing today and then we're we're thinking about getting up um, really early tomorrow maybe like 2 in the morning tomorrow and hiking the 9 or 10 miles to Clingman's Dome before sunrise and doing like uh, sunrise at Clingman's Dome I'm not sure if that'll actually happen we'll see I guess it'll be weather dependent and and uh, you know dependent upon other variables as in whether I feel like get rolling out of my bag if, if it's like 20 degrees I probably won't want to do that but we shall see um, but yeah
Things are going good. Oh, to continue on with the, the Foot Chronicles, um, the Solomon Trail Runners that I got at the Knock are doing good. Um, they're really giving me the support I needed for my arches, so I'm not having any of that foot pain when I get into camp. Still kind of doing the, the honeymoon phase with these guys as far as getting my heels used to them and everything like that, but it's nothing some moleskin and duct tape won't fix. Um, yeah, they look they look pretty rough, but uh, <clears throat> but yeah, they held up yesterday, and that, you know yesterday is probably the worst that they're gonna see. Um, they do let the water in; they're not by any means waterproof, um, but as easily as the water gets into these, it wicks out just as easily. So a little bit of sun, just like right now, I can already feel my feet are starting to get dry. They were pretty pretty wet still when I put them on this morning, but they're they're probably going to be dry by the time I get to the shelter today. I think we have like six more miles to go. Um, but yeah, I think that's it for right now. Um, we should be through the Smokies. Oh, I don't, I'm not sure if I told you. Today is Friday, April 5th. Um, and I'm thinking we're, we're talking about exiting the Smokies either Tuesday or Wednesday. I think it'll be Tuesday sometime. And then we'll stop by Standing Bear Hostel. And I know Lady's got a... Um, Lady's got a... Uh, a mail drop there and I've got potentially a mail drop there I'm not sure because I haven't checked my phone someone might be sending me something there but so we're gonna stop in there and just pick things up and continue on and then I think we got one more day in the hot springs so uh, yeah everything's going great I will check in with you guys later here I'll give you a view of what we're dealing with right now it's beautiful up here I'm just going to lay back and absorb this sun. All right, later, guys.